What is up? What is up, everybody? I am Kenny Bell, and I am back. And this week, it is a very special week because, baby, it is the beginning of March Madness. And any type of sporting occasion deserves some type of celebration, but especially March Madness. It's the most unique, and it's honestly, for me, it's one of the most fun to watch. Now, I am not a basketball analyst. I'm not a professional basketball player by any means. However, I am a professional in celebrating sporting occasions in the correct way. So today, I have a must-haves list for you for March Madness. Jumping right into it, which I think is probably one of the most vital, gotta have a way to get out of work, right? Everybody's asking, KB, how am I supposed to get out of writing my cover sheets for my TPS reports on a Friday? Well, you got to be creative. If you're, if you're lucky like me in Colorado, it snowed a ton. Make an excuse. Say you were shoveling snow, you slipped and hurt your back. Pow. Moving on. Obviously, guys, food, drink, and most importantly, your screen setup, right? Where you're going to watch the games. For me, you guys know what I eat. Crab legs, buffalo wings. You can never go wrong on any sporting occasion. Everyone will love you. Now, your screen setup is vital. I like to watch March Madness the way I watch the Masters. Two or three laptop screens, a monitor, and then the big screen for the big picture. You got to keep up with your favorite players, favorite games, but you got to stay locked into the, to the overall picture and see what's going on at the same time, guys. Next, I like to always have something that's soft to throw, like a pillow or something, or something that's easily breakable for when those brackets inevitably get completely ruined because you have Gonzaga in your final four. Anyway, <laughs> don't break your coffee table. Don't throw your chair at the television screen. You see crazy things. You know, get yourself a napkin to rip or some uh, chopsticks to break. You know? <laughs> Way cheaper. This is probably my important, most important rule, most important takeaway must have for the weekend. It is the NCAA tournament, but we are all Big Ten fans here. Set aside the petty rivalries from the season, from the years. I know that might be tough to say, but... Treat this like it's bowl season, guys. You obviously want your squad to win. That is the most important, but we want the conference to look great. Michigan fans, bounce back, baby, but forgive those Buckeyes for probably rubbing your face in it the last week or so for that Big Ten tournament uh, upset. Iowa and Illinois fans, lay off each other's necks, all right? Both great squads. We want to see everyone doing well. Me, personally, I've got the Illini winning it all, 77-75 to 75 over Bama. I've got Iowa in that final four. My bracket is a pretty much a love letter to the Big Ten, as I'm sure a lot of your guys' are. Let's have a great weekend. Throw me some comments. Let me know who you're rooting for, what kind of games you like. I'd like to keep this uh, good energy going through March Madness and uh, have some fun with you guys.